Hey, Twink, those guards have stopped paying attention to us again. Let's sneak out of here. We might be able to find some news to help Mario. Do you think it's still safe to use that secret path? Don't you think Bowser's figured it out by now? It's still alright, Twink. Bowser hasn't noticed anything. He looks scary, but he's basically a major bonehead. Let's get out of here. Come on. Princess Peach, and who might you be? Oh, you're Princess Peach. Everyone calls me the Gourmet Guy for some reason. I guess I'd better report you to King Bowser. You aren't supposed to leave your room. But I am really hungry. Tell you what, I'll keep this a secret if you make me something really yummy. So Princess Peach, what do you say? Will you cook me something or what? I'd love to cook for you, Mr. Gourmet Guy, but I have no ingredients and no utensils. Ah, that's no problem. There's a kitchen one floor below us. It's five star. You can go cook there. Here, you'll need this. This key will open the door that leads downstairs. Now we can get to the kitchen. Got the castle key. So I'll just sit here and wait for my yummy meal, okay? Oh yeah, I forgot. There are plenty of guards downstairs, so be careful. Obviously, it has to be this one. Well, here's the kitchen. So, what shall we do first? Princess Peach, this looks like a good cookbook. Let's use it, okay? How's it look, Twink? Anything look really yummy? Hang on a second. Oh, how about this? A special strawberry cake. Sounds good. Let's whip one up. Okay, Twink. Read me the recipe. Well... Okay, please listen carefully. First, put sugar and eggs in the bowl. Go ahead, Princess. When you finish, let me know, and we'll move on to the next step. Okay, we need sugar and flour. Where's the sugar? And the eggs. Done? Yes. Okay, let's move on to the next step then. Now, mix and whip the ingredients in the bowl. All set. When I say start, press A as fast as you can for 10 seconds to mix the batter. Are you ready? Start. Thank you. 
That's it. Great job. Did it go well, Princess Peach? Okay, let's go on to the next step then. Now, put flour and butter in the bowl. Go ahead, Princess Peach. Let me know when you're done and we'll move on to the next part of the recipe. Flour and butter. Butter. Put the butter in the bowl. Done? Yes. Okay, after you mix the ingredients in the bowl, pour it into the pan. On to the next step. Now, bake the batter in the oven for 30 seconds. Okay, head over to the oven. You can put the cake in the oven with A. Press A again when you think 30 seconds have passed, then take the cake out of the oven. You can't redo this part, so be extra careful. Okay, please put it in the oven. Done. Okay, put the cake on the table to cool. Okay, this is the last thing to do. We're going to decorate it with cream and strawberries. Let me know when you're all finished decorating. Uh, what? Kind of zoned out. No. Something about, yeah, strawberry? There's definitely something else. Cream? put more strawberries on. Is that gonna ruin it? No. Yes! We made it! It looks great! Okay, let's take this to Gourmet Guy. Or we could just bake the cake for four years and he'll still accept it. Here you go! Oh, I've been waiting so long, I've wasted away to nothing. Thank you. No! Blah! How oh, disgusting, this is awful! Where did you learn to cook? Truck driving school? Go back to the kitchen and follow a recipe or something. Hmm, no, 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 all wrong. Look at this decoration, awful! You shouldn't have too much or too little decoration on the cake, don't you know that? Try to use a little more care next time, okay? I feel sorry for the cake. Yay, I have to bake the cake again. Woohoo! Okay, Prince Peach, this time we're gonna make the delicious cake, alright? We sure are, I know I can. Uh, we can. Uh, this is gonna be the best cake you can make guys ever eaten. Okay, Twink, if you please read me that recipe again. Never where we left off. Power of baking in an oven. We should decorate it with the cream first, and then the strawberries, I guess. Oh well, let's do it right this time. Hey, that's one good looking cake, huh? All we have to do now is decorate it and we're done. Okay. What you want to do is put some cream on it first and then add the strawberries. I thought I had 
to redo the entire thing again. Okay, now everything's done the proper way. Yeah, it looks great, blah blah blah. Let's try to get this done already so I can move on. Here you go. Oh, I've been waiting so long, blah blah. Thank you. Oh! 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 Delicious! This is way too delicious! Phew, that was real good. I haven't felt this way since, well, ever. To show you my gratitude, I'll tell you a secret. One of the star spirits is inside Mount Lava Lava on Lava Lava Island. This island is to the south. You should tell this to Mario, but you'd better tell him that there's also a nasty lava piranha guarding the star spirit. You'd better be careful. I really don't dislike Mario. That's why I'm telling you this. Twink, did you hear that? Mount Lava Lava. Lava Lava Island. The star spirit is being held inside that volcano. Mario could really use this information, huh? Yes, he could. Twink, I'm sorry that I kept asking you to do this stuff, but can you go tell Mario? Oh, of course I will. I'll do it right now. I'll be back soon, Princess Peach. What's with all the shouting? Keep it quiet in here! So, it was you, Princess Peach. You got to keep it down. You're a prisoner, and as a prisoner, you need to keep... What? What are you doing here, out of your room anyways? Guards! Get the princess! No! Phew! Wow! Fresh air! After being cooped up in there for so long, I could really use some outdoor exercise. My name is Muscular. Mario, I must thank you for saving me. Now it's my turn to help you. Behold! Mario Star Energy goes up to 4. Mario can now use Chill Out, a new Star Spirit power. With Chill Out, you can lower the attack of all enemies. Call on me whenever you find yourself in trouble. I'll always come quickly to aid you in battle. Now, I'm going back to my dear old Star Haven. Mario! Mario, Mario, I have news. News from the castle. Honorable Star Spirit! Hi. Hmm. I believe you are Twink, no? You're the youngster who recently ascended from Starborn Valley up to Star Haven. What? You remember my name? Ha 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 ha. Why, of course. We're like family. I. I. I'm so touched. Ho ho ho. Don't make such a fuss, lad. I'm sure you'll go on to do great things. I must take my leave now. Goodbye, Twink Mario. Well, I talked with Muscular, the Honorable Star Spirit. I rarely have such a chance, even at Star Haven. I'm shaking. Oops, I'm sorry. I have some important news from the castle. According to the information Princess Peach and I got, it seems that one of the Honorable Star Spirits is being held at Mount Lava Lava on Lava Lava Island. You wouldn't believe what the Princess went through to get this information. I hope it will be of help. I'm going back to rejoin Princess Peach now. Mario, as always, good luck. 
The princess and I will keep looking for useful information. you say? Why, my dear old chap, I am none other than Colorado, famed adventurer and archaeologist. I'm touring the world, and you're a Mario, yes? What are you doing here? Well, I, for one, am traveling regularly to Lava Lava Island in the Southern Sea to solve a diabolical mystery. It would seem that there are uh, ancient treasure waiting in a volcanic cave I'm in a bit of a fix, though. No way to get there, you see. Hmm. Think now, Colorado. How to cross the sea. The dry, dry ruins dig grew tiresome for me. I left it in the hands of my assistants. I say, Mario, the artifact of yours. That looks like the subtle craftsmanship, indeed. Is a clue to dry, dry ruins. A careful study of this by... An experienced archaeologist like me could, well, solve the mystery of the ruins. Mario, old boy, be a chum. Could you part with it? Cheers, Mario. Smashing, really, old boy. Soon now, the mystery of dry dry ruins will rise from the sands that concealed it. As a brilliant archaeologist, I say it must be so. Mm, yes, of course, well... I suppose a thank you gift is in order. Hey, old boy! Here you go, then. I found it in Dry Dry Desert. I have no use for it. Now then, let's get down to Grass Tax. Hey, uh, let's solve this mystery in, in front of us. Ouch! Yeah! What are you doing? Oh, good heavens! I was wondering what this was. It seems to be a huge tuna. Ugh, I'm not a tuna, I'm a whale. And I have problems. It feels like something's jumping around in my belly. Ow, 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 help me! Hmm, I say, old boy, this great tuna seems to have a bit of a belly ache. Mario, what say you lend the fish a hand, eh? Hmm? Ugh, I told you, I'm not a tuna. I'm not even a fish. And I have a headache from your jumping around on me, too. Do you think that you could check my belly? I'm begging you, please. Yeah. Whoa, who that? What do you think you're doing with that light? Hey fella, you want a piece of this? You got it. I'm ornery as all ghetto. Prepare for some pain. Right, so I can't tattle on him. Because there's no light.
I don't know what to do now. I guess I can do it. Wait, I could do the hammer throw. Jerk! Can't use items now. Shucks, first I think I get away from that old fishing man, and then I get all swallowed up by some huge fish, and then this fella with the mustache goes upside my head. I've just been falling out of frying pans and into fires since I was just a little grub. Talk about a lousy lot in life. Mario, it's me. You know the whale. Can you hear me? That stomachache seems to have cleared right up. I feel fantastic. Except we're gonna drown and die. Whoosh! Hey, it's you, boy. You're that dumb old fish that ate me all up and such. You plum idiot. You know, I thought I was a goner for sure. I'm awfully sorry. I was just having a nap with my old mouth open. Well, I suppose I can see my way to forgiving you this time, but you just watch it. Er, I reckon I owe you some thanks after all, Mr. Mustache. Y'all take care now. Whew, I feel so much better now. They should call you Dr. Mario. There must be some way I can express my gratitude. I've got it. I, the tuna, uh, am, I mean. I, the whale, am quite good at swimming. To express my thanks, I'll take you anywhere you want to go. Pardon the eavesdropping, but did you just say anywhere? Mario, you old tuna tamer, accompany me to the shores of Lava Lava Island. What a trip it'll be. The island will be wonderful. You must trust my instincts. Mario, um, I think the star kid said a uh, star sphere was, um, caught on the big lava lava island. We, um, we should go. Big whale, give us a ride. Whee! Huh? Lava lava island? Yes, of course. I know where it is, but there is a big volcano on the island and it's on the verge of erupting. Very dangerous. Do you still want to go? Totally. Well, okay then. It's your call. Just let me know when you're ready to go. I have to really talk in front of him. You want to go to Love Love Island? Yes. Let's just get there already. Oh, sure, this is safe then. Make some room, huh? Okay, we're up to Lava Lava Island. The sea is calling. I can't believe we're on a tuna, Mario. Do you ever think about how strange life can be? I do. Chapter 5, Hot Hot Times on Lava Lava Island. If you want me to take you back to Toad Town, just ask. Yes, we'll finally made it, eh? So this is Lava Lava Island's smashing. Gracious! Behold, Mario! There, off in the distance, the top of Mount Lava Lava! 
Triumphant! We must hurry! Make haste! Where is a save block? Can't just bounce me off of there. Yeah! Help, I say! Help! Oh, we got a letter up there. Oh, Mario! You're supposed to attack the other guy, old bean! Do you have issues with me? A bit of jealousy, perhaps? This is the Jungle Fuzzy. Jungle Fuzzies are very similar to other fuzzies, but they live in the jungle, so that's her name. Max HP 7, attack 2. They cling to you, suck out your HP, and add it to their own. What a sleazy move. They won't stop clinging to you unless you tear them off with the action command. They also occasionally divide, so let's beat them before they get the chance. You saved me. Many things, old chum. Well, enough of that. Let's pull ourselves together and press on. What say? Finally at the Yoshi Village. block. Yeah, I don't, don't want to talk to you yet. Yeah, let's just get out of here. Talk to this fish. Oh, it's so rare to have visitors these days. I'd love to stop and chat, but I have my fins full. I'm watching these boys who are very, very naughty, so they don't do anything dangerous. I can't prove it yet, but I bet they're planning something. Well, if they think they can fool sushi, they better think again. Yeah, that's gonna be everything for today. Goodbye.